you'll need a lot of energy today. Yeah, but I didn't take so much uh, now, but I still have uh, some muesli and uh, some bread more. But for sure we need uh, lots and lots of uh, carbs today. Simone, I've got no doubt that after yesterday's stage you are all a bit tired. Talking about today, we'll have another tough stage. Can you describe it for us? It will be a really hard stage. We'll start in Busto Arsizio and from that moment on, we'll have a continuous up and down and some roundabouts before facing the first climb, the Valcava, a first category king of the mountain. So, a hard one. From that point on, we'll start to go uphill and then downhill and so on till the finish line in Pian de Resinelli. And in a day like that, uh, we could see also big changes in VGC, isn't it? After 12 days of Giro without any rest day, this could be the most important one for the general classification. Do you want to tell me something about yesterday's stage? It has been really humid, an important sudden change in temperature, long climbs, and then the finale was quite good for us with Tira Longo ahead and myself finishing with only a few seconds delay. And Roman, what about after the stage? Well, we went from the finish to the hotel using an helicopter. It was funny being there surrounded by the clouds and seeing all the people queuing on the route. Tell me something about today's stage when we will be on the car and you will be there working so hard. You'll be in a warm place having the chance to decide about the right temperature while we will suffer on the climbs under the rain. It actually seems to be not so bad here right now. So today it will be another really important day, am I wrong? The climbs will be shorter but harder so the delays will be bigger, we'll see. Yesterday a tough stage but also today it's an hard one so once again the importance of the messages and in a few days it's your turn. Yes, I'll check them today and especially tomorrow during the rest day. They are tired, but they don't have any particular problem. Anyway, I need to help them because a good recovery means more energy for the final part of the Giro. You know, for the GC men, the Giro started yesterday. So there is a great collaboration between you and the masseur? Yes, of course. The masseur treats the riders and then I make a sort of recovery therapy checking them and solving any eventual problem. So can we make uh, just a brief interview tomorrow during the treatment? We've got to ask the riders, but I think there will be no problem. Hi everybody, this morning we woke up and we have had breakfast with our riders. They told us about their sensation after yesterday's stage that has been really, really tough. What about today? It will be another demanding stage because we will have 169 kilometers. So let's see what will happen during this stage and we will talk later after the stage. See you later. Good results also today for the Pro Team Astana riders with the 1 minute 26 gap from the pink jersey of Paolo Tiralongo. 1 minute and 27 seconds for Roman Kreuziger. So the appointment is for tomorrow. We won't have another stage. We will have the rest day. But we will discover during that day a lot of things. So stay tuned.